Hey guys, absolutely Looney, aka Looney, bringing you another Find That Train Challenge yet on town yet again. And uh, today we're going to be doing the Top of Jug uh, train. Uh, I haven't done it in a while, I was just feeling it. It's pretty. It's a pretty fun train, especially if you're not uh, used to them. It's like a train that helps you um, like learn how to train, or at least uh, get really good at them. As I said, it's like um, it's a really simple one. There's there's not a lot of like complicated uh, things going on with it. You don't have to like um, you have to like shake your screen a lot. You don't have to uh, sprint a lot. You just just uh, go with the flow. Uh, the rules are you can't uh, you can't buy jug. You have to start it on uh, 15 or 20. Uh, I like 20 because fast response. Um, you can't kill the zombies until you have a full wave, and you complete the challenge by having a full wave. So uh, let's see. I uh, it's a pretty simple one. I did it a couple of days ago um, on my first try, so I should be able to get it. So I see. Um, what I like to do here is try to oh, shit. Try to stay on that area. Ah, uh, see, so see, those walkers are really annoying because they block your path if you have to uh, like run around here. Um, but it's pretty big. See, the um, the good thing about training in here is that it's like really big. And there's a lot of uh, like room for errors. Uh, I I kind of like messed up that uh, this train, which is uh, where where I like to train them at. And uh, when that happens, you can always uh, go to this like side, which is also which is also pretty easy to train at. And um, ooh yeah, I guess I'm just gonna have to back out. I mean, I completed the challenge. That's uh, it's all the runners. Yeah, that's all the runners. No, you don't count the walkers because it would be like a lot harder to count the walkers. And yeah, see, uh, as I said, it's uh, it's one of the like best ones to start doing this uh, find the train challenges because it's not really that difficult. Uh, this is I don't know. That's it's one of the ways how I like to learn to train uh, or how to do really tight trains. I mean, that's not as tight as other trains, but yeah. All right, uh, I guess I'm just gonna end it right here. Ah. <laughs> no, I'm gonna try to go down in style. Yeah. 